Dolphins defensive back Tory McTire, right, breaks up a pass intended for Minnesota Vikings wide receiver Stacy Coley, left, during the first half of a preseason game. AP photo Bruce Cluck and Davey, cornerback Tory McTire had to be as tired as every other Dolphin when their flight from London landed close to 2 a.m. But sleep was out of the question. As soon as the Dolphins landed, McTire received a distress call from his girlfriend. She works in the restaurant at Mandalay Bay on the Las Vegas Strip, site of a mass shooting Sunday evening that has claimed 58 lives. McTire's girlfriend, along with co-workers, had barricaded themselves in a storage room at the Hot El Casino. Making a terrifying time worse, her phone's battery was running out of power. When her phone died, it made me more concerned, because I'm not hearing from her, McTyre said. Prayers out to those family friends who were affected in the event last night. Vegas is a second home to me to see this happen is saddening a thorn. Tori McTyre at the interim tier October 2, 2017 Three hours went by before McTyre got the news he prayed for. During the interval, McTyre had kept abreast on the happenings on the news. They took them out of the storage room that they were hiding in and put them towards one of the hotel rooms, McTyre said. Once she got her phone in the charger and texted me, I knew she was good. McTyre calls Las Vegas his second home, having played at UNLV. He has been to Mandalay Bay a few times and said he never was concerned for his safety on the Vegas Strip. Not at all, because the people of Vegas are good people, he said. There's a lot of people who come to Vegas just to either have fun or they take vacation, so you never really think that something like this would happen. Hearing from his girlfriend ended a long day that included the Dolphins' loss to the New Orleans Saints at Wembley Stadium, followed by a long flight to Miami. The team didn't arrive back at its training facility in Davie until 2.45 a.m. Once she texted me and told me she was okay, I was able to sleep, McTyre said. Column Dolphins coach Adam Gass sounds lost as a fence sputters Lawrence Timmons speaks after his Dolphins debut grading the Dolphins after their 200 loss to the Saints photo gallery live images from Dolphins Saints tilt in London check out the Palm Beach Post's Miami Dolphins page on Facebook.